This is this this is child. <gasps> Don't tell nobody I didn't tell y'all this, but Hello, you guys. Happy. Um, I think this is a new vlog. Welcome back to another vlog. I'm not gonna say weekly, because it may be daily, day in life, maybe a couple days. Welcome back to another vlog. It's Adrian. It is currently 1:30. Um, I'm out of breath because I've been cleaning for the past, whew, I guess, 30 minutes. Um, and I'm out of shape. And I'm hot. It was cold in here earlier. Now I'm hot. Now I'm hot. Um, today's Wednesday. Happy Hump Day. Tomorrow's Fourth of July. I took off yesterday and Friday because we were supposed to. We were just supposed to go to Galveston, but I think I told y'all, or if I didn't tell y'all, we ended up not doing it. I'm happy we didn't because Michael called me today and said that he has to work Friday. He's supposed to be off Friday. He has to work Friday because somebody got into an accident, and the form he the his boss said that somebody has to volunteer to work on Friday because they were shorthanded and the other two guys had already had trips paid for and planned so Michael volunteered to stay but imagine how we had paid for the Airbnb and then we would have to cancel and this late in the game probably wouldn't have got our money back so he volunteered to work so he's not off Friday so really we just have tomorrow with him who was supposed to go to the water park today with the girls and forgot today they're actually at tutoring this is their first day of tutoring I dropped them off at 1 o'clock, pick them up at 2.30 because it's 45 minutes for each one of them. So we'll see how it goes. She seems super nice when I dropped her off. She's lost a lot of weight. Compared to the picture, for the, her Venmo picture to who I, who I dropped her off to, she's lost a lot. Of, I was like, who, who, who is she? And then she's like, I'm Kate. I'm like, you look 20 years younger than in the picture. <laughs> so first thing I think, every time I, think, every time, every time I see somebody that lost weight, I always think she must be on the shot. I know. I shouldn't be thinking that. Some people actually... Um, diet and exercise to lose the weight. Everybody, the shot is not the answer for everybody, but that's just so popular. And when you say the shot, it covers everything. Ozempic, Manjaro, uh, Wigovi, all of that. And even that, uh, the, the Sexenda, even that one. Saxenda, Sexenda, however it is. But I am tired, I'm out of breath. I have been working all morning. Um, I took the girls to swim lessons this morning and I've been working, but I came on here to show you guys I got some packages that came in the mail, so I'm gonna do a little bit of unboxing. See what's what. I don't. Oh Jesus, y'all! I promise. I promise. If this is something from Micah, off of that freaking TikTok shop, he gonna need a new home. I know I'm messing with y'all because I don't want nobody in my comments saying you shop too, but he don't tell you that. <gasps> ah, I got skin potion. It's in already. I did not know this was coming. This is not supposed to be here until the end of the month. I'm so happy that I'm recording then. That can give my first real raw impression because everybody has been like raving that this new scent is the best of the best. Some TikTok shop clothes for me. I guess I can't really talk, huh? Uh, Alex, you got a package. <coughs> Black line car care. I don't know what he's ordering. And this package is really heavy. My figure ID. And I'll tell him what he didn't order or offer. A tool. Something that's tools. The boy in that TikTok shop. <coughs> Alright, where should we start first? We're going to start off with my TikTok shop stuff. Actually, I want to go to my office and do this because I want to do a little try on with y'all on this. I wasn't doing it on TikTok shop, but I really, I mean, I'm going to do a real, do a TikTok on the try on, but I might just do like a try on reel later, but I'm going to give y'all just like a, a raw impression. So let's go to my office real quick. All right, y'all. I'm going to just put this really low. But I'm scared if I put it literally low, it's going to be copyrighted. Although I have really haven't been having any issues lately with my copyright, which is quite a surprise. Maybe, maybe uh, YouTube say they ain't worried about it. And I got the PR. So I'm going to do a quick little unboxing. I'm hot. I guess I could take, excuse me, I could take this hat off, but 
we're gonna, we're gonna keep it moving, y'all. All right, this first box is from Saltaire. I wasn't sure if I was still on their PR list, but I just think they haven't had any new releases and they have a new release. So I really wanna do a TikTok showing all of these tried on, but today I'm gonna show y'all this, but I really wanna do like a makeup, a face makeup, and then like a re-unboxing. A re-unboxing of it, but they got some new summer shades of their lip oil balms. I love these a lot. They have the pigment on these is like a truly a lip gloss, like to be not even a really a lip oil. But I'm gonna try one of these on with y'all real quick. This one is in shade Orchid. Uh, let me shade on under my lips <laughs> so I can get the raw. This almost matched the color of my nails. Um, here's how it looks out the tube. Oh, it's like a purplish color. Let's see. Is it sheer? Ah, oh, okay. You got like a, oh, it smells so good. Oh, that smells so good. To me, they are scented. So if you don't like scents, then you might not like this, but that's pretty. Let me see. Do I have a light? I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like under a light, but oh, here we go. Let me get it real quick. So I feel like I'm not doing it any ju any justice if I'm not giving y'all the full. Yeah, I could definitely see it in the over there, but too bright. Do this better. It's pretty with a liner, but that's what I'm saying. Like you get pigment. It's like ooh, ghost stories. <laughs> you get pigment off of these so I love this I love Saltaire but that's a lot of shades I thought it was gonna come up with three or four because I think their first launch was this much and I did a TikTok on it was showing all of them I had makeup on and I showed the pigment and how they each looked I like these look alls so we got a hold to a couple of them and chewed them up and then Mala took some so I can't tell you where all of them are, all the original ones that I have but I had them so let's talk about this next this next package is skin potion all right, so Skin Potion, I have, like I said before, almost all of his shades, all of his scents from his website. I've spent well over $700 with him. Um, Uh-oh, it's kind of kind of leaking a little. It's kind of leaking through the box. Oh, wait, why do I smell it already? This is what I'm saying, like his stuff, be potent and I think anybody who likes fragrance I'm not affiliated with him he don't even know who I am y'all this smell good already like I haven't even I just the, the aroma from the box the spill the spillage out of the box as you can see <sighs> now Kama Sutra is my number one and I don't think any of his other fragrances touch that one but the girlies on all this I guess his influencers Perfume enthusiasts, all of them say that this knocks Kama Sutra out the park. So we're gonna see. This is the newest scent called Alma Divina, is what this one is. Um I think the throwing in Kama Sutra is, is quite a stretch. Let me let me see because okay I got the butter and I got the um the oil. To me his oils oh I, think I may have gotten a little rip because some of it spills out. But it's fine it's fine it happens you know I still have stuff in here although part of me is like girl I want every penny because this bottle is a hundred dollars it ain't it ain't cheap. Okay okay okay. Let me wipe this off. Um, hold on, y'all. No lie, I'm a little salty. Like, I kind of want to inbox them and be like, listen, my, my jar is broken and leaking. Like, but I just don't know if he's going to replace it or not. But I'm not happy about that because, as you can see, the jar is broken. It's like the whole bottom of this thing is missing. I don't know what I'm gonna do about that. I mean, I'll ship it back. 
Um, anywho. Okay. It does smell good. It does smell good. Um, let me see how it smells on my skin. Because some of the some of the oil wastes off into this top. Shower, but guess not, I guess not enough. So let's see. I kind of smell, I was wondering, me and my coworker was like, what does champagne smell like? And I was just like, I don't know what champagne smells like, but it has like peaches, champagne, lily of the valley. Look at the notes of it. And uh, okay, it's given the projection of Kama Sutra. I'm not gonna lie. It's definitely like projection. It does smell good. It does smell good, but I just don't feel like it tops Kama Sutra. I really don't think it tops Kama Sutra. Kama Sutra just, I don't know. And it doesn't, this doesn't, this doesn't smell like any other scent that I own either. So I do feel like it is a, but I can, I kind of smell the champagne, like the bubbly scent. I do smell the champagne in it. It does smell good. Don't get me wrong. I'm, I don't regret buying it like at all. It does smell good, but I don't think it's groundbreaking. To, okay, so if I had to rate it, my number one is Kama Sutra. She's there still. And I think under her would be Aphrodisiac. That one smells really good. Oh, I love that one so much. And then this one, the Alma Divina. To me, that's just my personal, that's just my personal um, thing. But yeah, so it has champagne e extract, aloe vera, Moroccan organ oil, watermelon seed oil, cherry seed oil, and lily of the valley. So yeah, that's it. Skin potion. I, I don't know. Like a part of me is like really contemplating just inboxing and saying. But and then the other part of me is like, I'm gonna be pissed off <laughs> if they don't re if they don't uh, replace it. Um I, I don't know. Which I think I should do. Just let it go. It's a small business. Just let it go. Because I still have the body butter, which I like the body butter a lot. I, I haven't used this one, but all his other body butters I like. See, the other ones I have is hard. This one is soft. This is what I like. It's super soft. The other one I gotta use a spatula to get out. I don't know if it's because he used different things or what, but um, yeah. And he stays sold out all the time. So good marketing, good marketing skills that he has like different launches of uh, different things. So it can constantly, um, people always going to want it because it always stays sold out. It does smell good. It does smell good. But it does not take over Kama Sutra. Kama Sutra is still that girl. She will always be that girl. Yeah, it smells good. I don't know. What should I do? By the time this video go live, I would have made my decision by now on what I'm going to do. If I'm going to just keep it. Or get them to replace it. Like I like, like I'm. Yeah, because I've had these other ones and I've used them several times, and those have more. So I'm missing kind of a lot out of this. Moving on. Moving on, Adrian. I'm telling myself, don't cry over spilled milk. But then at the same time, I'm like, girl, your hard earned coins. Business is business. Small, small, black owned or not, business is business. So I don't know. What do I do? What do I do? And then now that I have this on, I'm still gonna keep smelling. But y'all know how some fragrances like they stick up on you, like the scent like sticks up, and you're like, oh, it smells good. And it's, it's like, oh. So I'm hoping, hopefully, this one. It has. I think it's. I think it's one. Like in the thing, it has champagne and peaches. So it's kind of a sweet, sparkly scent. I can't really. Um, it. Why did I get this dress? Why did I get this dress? This is pretty. This is from TikTok shop. Let's do a little try on real quick. All right, I'm gonna give y'all the whole try on, which I don't know how this is gonna look with this camera because I have this wide angle lens. But this is the dress, a dress from TikTok shop. It comes, y'all can't even see how far it comes, huh? I don't know why this angle is just not good. If I do this, can y'all see the full, full length, full body length? It comes like right down to my ankles is where this skirt, this dress goes. This is a cute day night, day night um, dress. This is it has to have ordered a medium. I pretty much order all my clothes in mediums. But this one is cute. I think 
you know, with some clear heels with this and then I would pair it with like a pop of, pop of color, pink, pink lip, stick, pink bag, and probably clear shoes. This perfume is sneaking up on me. Like every time I walk, I get a whiff of it. It does smell good. It does smell good. But I keep saying it, it's good, but she's still number three, so. All right, dress, sorry, get kind of sidetracked. Side yeah, I would do like with this pink um, bag with it. It's like this monochromatic, this was super cheap. TikTok shop, I had a comment on one of my Facebook posts and they were like, do you do TikTok shop fashion? And I'm like, girl, you gotta follow me on TikTok shop. Cause yes, I do. I do do TikTok fashion, but I don't cross post that because I can't link it. Like, I can't link it, sis. So yeah, this is the first outfit. I don't know how much it costs. If I can look it up, I'll put it on the screen to tell you guys how much this was. But all of the clothes that I shop are super cheap, super affordable. So this is the first outfit I got. Okay, here's outfit number two. Come on, TikTok shop. Come through, TikTok shop. I love that I can't with my hair. I can't with my hair. No, nope, just focus on this. I just feel like the whole outfit would come together if I had the full look going, but let's just look at this. Look at the body, okay? Focus on the body. I think this is so cute, and the quality of, this, quality of this is really, really good. I don't know why I've been buying all this vacation stuff. I'm telling you, I, I won't have to buy a thing for vacation, okay? When I go somewhere for my 40th birthday, I won't have to buy a thing. I love this. And I could even do, again, a pop of color, or I could keep it simple with just a black bag or accessorize it. You can layer your necklaces, you can wear your hair up, do some big earrings. I think it's cute, which y'all, can y'all even see me back there? Is that a good angle? I don't even know. But it's a little two piece, just a little two piece girl from TikTok shop. Cute piece. I stay with the black and white theme. This is cute too. It has pockets. I like it. It's that, uh, it's the, the loose breathable material. So that works for me. Um, the elastic, you know, gives you some compression. Uh, this is cute. Black and white. I can. I would probably wear this with some tennis shoes, my Adidas Sambas to be exact, and I don't want y'all a bag. I could do a pop of color bag or a little sling body bag, depending on what I'm doing, what I'm doing for the day. But this is cute. Definitely a cruise outfit. Definitely a cruise outfit. But I can't remember, I'll try to keep the prices somewhere on the screen. All right, so here's the last outfit that's gonna probably, probably, no, it will be returned. Like, it's just, this is, this, this is, child, I ain't even, girl, I ain't going out. I am not going out with this on. This, I guess I didn't realize it was so deep cut here. Um, and it has the elastic in the back. The shorts are just some booty shorts. Like, if, if I can see my stretch marks all the way up here, it's a no for me. I'm not wearing these shorts. Um, it's a linen, a linen three-piece set, but I, it's just, the pants are actually tight too. The shorts are tight, so this is a no for me. So I do have one fail, and the rest of them are goes. But yeah, that's my little TikTok try on, child. That's my little TikTok try on. Girl, not my boot, girl. The whole thing out. Mm -mm.
happy 4th of July, you guys. Oh, it is eight o'clock. Y'all ready? We're about to go to the fireworks downtown. They have this every year. I look a hot mess. I haven't been anywhere today. I've actually, literally, this is my pajamas from last night. <laughs> Seriously. Um, I put on some, change some shorts from my, my pajama pants and some shorts just so I can look a little presentable to go outside to, for the girls to go on and sip inside. I had got this dress from H&M last year for 4th of July, for my 4th of July look, and I never wore it. So I think I'm gonna wear this tonight to go to the fireworks and put on a baseball cap because my hair is still looking like who did it and why. Um, I was sick last night. I don't know, like I had an ice cream cone late last night and I shouldn't have ate that. But you could have sworn I was lactose intolerant, baby, because I, I was like, okay, God, I won't eat ice cream sandwich again anymore. I was thinking in my head, is this what y'all feel like when y'all drink and eat dairy? Because I can see why y'all are like, I don't want to, I want to stay away from it because my stomach was in, but once I went, I was fine. Like I went back to sleep after that, but it woke me up, but like it woke me up out of my sleep at one o'clock this morning. Just how bad my stomach was hurting. I'm sorry if it was TMI, but I posted my video today of my 100K, um, the reel that I showed you guys on the other day. I posted that on my platforms. I... <sighs> Somebody keeps emailing, emailing me off of Facebook and saying my, my account's going to be de deleted because I keep using copyrighted music, but I'm just so confused because like even, even my video, like my views have been super low on Facebook, like one to 2,000 views. And typically I, I could get 22,000 views in, in a day. Like my reels used to like take off on Facebook and they've been suppressed really. So then I was like, dang, is this, is this real? Because I always have people say like, that's how they hack you. That's how they. So I'm, I don't. I don't ever know if like this is something I should be attention, paying attention. What? If this is something I should pay attention to, I don't. I don't have any notifications on my stuff. But I'm like, my views are low. So I'm like, is my page really about to be deleted because of Stop. music? So I really don't even know what's going on. What y'all doing? So I don't really know what's going on with that. So I have to try to figure it out. Just I ain't got time today. You ready? You just hollered, are you ready? We told you, yeah. You bringing a towel with you? It's hot. You about to put that on? Yeah. I'm gonna just, can you turn it on? I gotta pee. Okay, he has to go pee, y'all. So let me get out of here and we'll catch you guys at the fireworks. Okay, so we made it out to the fireworks. Better light it this way. Um, and I had to throw a hat on because y'all saw how my hat was looking. But it's still daylight. The, the, uh, the fireworks aren't, isn't until nine o'clock, so we got time to wait. So what's we gonna do? Just sit in the back of the truck and wait. And it's already starting to get kind of packed already. Out here with people, it's always a lot of people here. So looking forward to a good time. Hopefully not a long time, but a good time. The loud ones at the end. Very loud. You remember when DJ couldn't hear us? Fourth of July fireworks. That's it. <laughs> I 
that I will wait upon you, Lord. Even when I cannot find the answers, why I still count on. Patience have its perfect way. I will wait upon you, Lord. Yeah, and I will wait upon you, Lord. And I will wait upon you, Lord. Friday going to the store. I want to go to take them to TJ Maxx to see if we can find their um, backpacks. backpacks for school. I want to see if those are out. I, 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 I'm thinking they're in the morning. And I'm putting on my lash extensions. I like to do them in the morning. I think I've said this before in the past that if I try, I tried, girl, I caught myself doing them one night before I went to bed. Girl, I woke up, my eyes was this. This was my eyes. I had to peel them open. I said, oh, okay. They're not dry all the way, so they dried shut. So now I do mine in the morning. If I, if I can at least have at least six to eight hours to let them dry with my eyes open. I think it's currently like 10.30, so it's a little late in the morning, but it's fine. I got my outfit out of what I'm wearing today. My niece and my sons, uh, the cousins, went crabbing this morning. They didn't invite us. They're, they're grown now. They're all young adults. It's up. Andre, Andre's the youngest. All the other ones are graduated and are in school. Um, graduated college, graduated high school. Um, so, 
yeah I am putting this on here that's the bulk we may have to go out of town tomorrow may if something works out then we'll go but if not it just ain't my time yet you know what I'm saying it's all in God's time God opens the door makes a way and perfect if not not yet so how they say it delayed not denied um, I'm sweating. Can y'all turn the fan on, Malia? Uh, I'm like, I'm legit sweating. The sun, y'all. It's been so hot. Yeah. How are y'all making it out? How are y'all making it? I just, I just got to yeah. Turn the fan on, please, for me. In here? No, the remote control. Y'all got dog on glue at the end of my thing. Okay, I'm going to put some more music on. I just wanted to talk because I feel like I've been wait, just recording my, what I'm wait, doing. What, what, what is the same thing? This one. Oh, you. you got 30 seconds to do that. Ooh, 30 seconds. This one? Better hurry up. Ooh, girl. That's how you put the fan on. That's how you turn the fan on. Yeah, girl. Why you got on two headbands, Malia? Once you put your glue down, just let it kind of dry down a little bit before you start putting them, applying them to your lashes. So, I map mine out like this and I let them sit for like not that long. Just so I can get a little tacky. This earring always flipping on me. I get it from I got it from Old Navy or Amazon, one of them places. But it gives the illusion of like six yeah, one more thirty seconds. Just one. Oh, okay. I'm gonna stop talking and hurry up. Go, go, mommy, go, go faster, go faster. Girl, I'm not trying to mess up my lashes to play with y'all. Minutes left. You better hurry up. Two minutes left. Yeah, still trying to subliminally rush me. Y'all, why my camera overheating? It's okay. saying I'm doing too much. Let me just show y'all this really quickly and then some of y'all this. I don't show this much as I used to show my eyelash extensions, but I still wear them. This is the, okay. it's like I'm missing the last part. And you just place it right underneath your lash. Watch my Ooh, why am I shaking? Oh, I got some glue under my eyelid. Which one? Do like that? Yeah, like that. That's not gonna work because it's gonna pull through. Ooh, that burns. Okay, my camera about to die. I'm gonna show you what I look like once my camera cool off. So just BRB. All right, you guys. Lashes are on. I had to switch cameras because my other one is still overheating. So here's my lashes. Hair pulled back. Let me show y'all the little oh oh. TV. Malia. I think they heard you. Here's my little jumper outfit. I already did a try on with this thing. It's so like I feel I have nothing on. I I love this jumper so much. It's like linen material, wide leg with the um thing, and then the back of it is like a little tie here. So I think, oh, for my try on, I did a, a strapless undershirt. Today I did this little V-neck thingy from um, Shein. But I want to put a cap on because my ends, I need to wash my hair, but I'm probably do it, do it when? Sunday. Y'all, so y'all remember me saying, okay, yeah, of course y'all remember because it's the same vlog. Okay, so this is my first time wearing the Alma Divina in this today. Is I have it on and I put the oil over my legs and then I topped it. Let me go see what I topped it with so I can show y'all. So I can give y'all the accurate combo. But that's all I'm going to do. I'm going to just say I smell so delicious. AJ sleeping because he was out late last night. He didn't stay here last night. He know anytime he out he he out late, he go say, I'm gonna stay to my dad's house. I got like three six seconds. He would tell me you got home, sir. Four this morning you got home. And then he went crabbing at six. So he's sleeping out. And I should be the be the mom to go in there. Can you please put that up? And put shoes on. Tell tell my little put her shoes on too. Anyways, look out for my children. Um, because I remember when I was 20, so I was doing the same thing. So let me just I mean, I forget where I came from. Uh, praise the perf, praise the perf, perfume, or perfume. Focus failed. Oh, the little DJI camera kind of talks to me. Focus failed, but praise the per, praise the perfume. This is a dupe to something. It's giving. I didn't spray my clothes yet. Oh, it's like a clean scent, and the Alma Divina is like a sweet champagne scent. I don't know why I just. Can you put some on me? 
правда. I don't know why I always choke myself out, but that's what I do. Girl, you can get some body spray. You don't even know. You don't even know perfume. Come on, get some body spray for you. But I'm gonna put my shoes on. I want to put on my same hat that I wore yesterday. My little, I ordered me another one of these yesterday for Amazon because I'm like, I have a really big head and these hats fit me and I love it and I'm here for that. So, let me set you right here. What, baby? Um, I got this from. You, you, you got pockets in the bag. Where, Amber Combee? No, where did I get this hat from? But, Mom, you got pockets. Amber Combee and Fitch? No, girl. Amber Combee and Fitch is Amber Combee. Please stop. Why are you doing annoying things like that? Poking me and why? why? You want me to poke you and, and do all that to you to annoy you? Okay. Mommy don't like that. And I told you that 15 times. And she still just comes. She come behind me and just poke me in my booty. Poke me in my booty. Poke me in my stomach. Poke. Girl, stop. These kids be trying me. All right. Let me go put um, some earrings on and then we're going to go. What shoes am I going to wear this? I don't know. Let me go. All right. I put on some tennis shoes, but now I'm kind of starting to feel like this don't look that great, but it's comfortable. So I have on these little, my uh, New Balance, my bad shoes. They got some blue in them. So I don't know. I don't think it's, I don't think it's the cutest outfit, but I'm still working with today, girl. Let's go eat some crabs. Come on, baby. We made it to um, Home Goods. What's about my mom? My, 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 we went by my mom's house, but um, my niece and my niece and my nephew's uh, girlfriend went to the store, and they hadn't even started cooking yet. So I was like, I'm about to just go ahead and go to the store and then come back later. So that's what we're gonna do now. They're gonna push the basket for me, so we can see what we're gonna get or find. Be careful. We can get Zoe a treat. A treat. Get my basket, please. Y'all were just fighting to get the basket. Not the, these kids here. Let's get her some treats because she's out of treats. Lord have mercy. Let me go. The last time I brought the girls some clothes, I thought I had brought um, a size six and seven. And I brought, I think, two sixes. So and both of those are from Malia. So I told Mala I owe her an out two outfits today. So let me see what I can. This is cute. This is a Vince Pimuto dress. That's kind of cute. Oh, and look what they at with the toys and the girly stuff, of course. Mala, come see. Let's even try to wear these. She needs some more shirts. Like right now, today she got on just a white tee. Like it's probably date Jaden, her cousin's shirt. But she just needs some little white tees. I mean, white shirt. Can I go try them on? No, you don't need to. You, you can't try these on. I love it. What? I love it. See how I get sidetracked? Buy stuff I don't need because of them. Let's see. Oh, this is cute. But I don't know. It comes with a jacket. It's too hot for a jacket. But the print of this is really cute. What, baby? She has to get this. She has to get this. I asked if she liked this other outfit. She said, I didn't like that. So I'm going to just buy that. Your head too big. You got a big head like your mama. You can't fit it, girl. So I'm going to just buy her what I want. I'm going to tell her what she going to wear. That's what's going to work for us today. So they don't have a lot to choose from for backpacks. It's early July, so let's kind of come back maybe at the end of the month and see what they have. You just want one just to have one, my little. I want you to get one that you love. That one you don't love just yet. I'm not getting this long line. Some gum on my in my tire. All right, so we left there, and now we're about to go to Five and Below because. Because they couldn't find a toy, and you know, it's all about them. They have to have something. They have to have something. They don't have something, something's wrong. I'm a bad mommy, they don't get anything. Spoil kids. Here's the crabs that they got from the bridge, the water. The, the bridge water. 
Whatever you want to call it. Let me close the door. Is that real? Is there, um, and that's are they alive? Friend. How many? Baby, who won't eat that? One, two. Don't put your finger in there. One, two, three, four, five. They're still alive. This is some baby little baby crabs. They're sleeping. They put them on ice, look like. They're sleeping. So, yeah, they, they, they're nice and sleepy. We brought some snow crab legs and some shrimp too to go with it because, baby, who gonna eat this? Who gonna eat this? A, a bag in it. Not I. Yeah, don't get, don't, it's gonna snap your finger off. Don't get your, don't put your hand in there. What's up? Yes, ma'am. Good. Did you say you could give us some stickers? What's the one? What are you talking about? What sticker? Um, what? hi. What's this sticker? No, um, sorry y'all, that. A lot going on. Did you? Did, 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 oh, okay. Did, did, did I was like, what you talking about? I'm in my store. No, I haven't done that video. Yet. That's some clothes. That's some returns. So I'm in my office. It's still Saturday night. But went to my one? parents' house. Yes, I done that. I done that video already, and the brand approved it. I just had one little chance. They've been itching to get into my. Um, I told y'all I had sponsorship with Belief and their summer collection. I mean, not Belief. Sojo's. And belief, and they had these purses in in the collection. The stickers is right here. Whoopsies. And the purses. Oh, you want the stickers? Oh, it came with the stickers and the purses. And the girls have been asking me, "Mama, have you done the video? Have you done the video?" Because told them don't do touch anything until the brand's approved. Brand approved it. So I they approved it. That, I want to make one, one of those change. Purses in there. You're gonna have it. Um, they did tell me to change one thing, and I, which was just adding oh. something on the screen. That, that's um, what I need. Day. And so they're each gonna get this. I love when the girls can capitalize off of sponsorships. This was by accident. They didn't send this for the girls, but I think this was just a part of the. Um... Wait a minute, is this two? Yeah. Are they together? Oh, no. it's stuck. Yeah, mommy. Oh, there we go. Okay, there's one for you. And there's one for you. <gasps> you Yay! Uh, out, uh, we can hold it like this. There you go. You got your purses and they stickers. And they happy now. Look, Bobby, it's Why like do a I soda. feel like I look blurry? Let me try Wait, to have soda. Have soda. Soda? Okay, that's better. So, okay, I, I'm sitting here um, trying to prepare for the next time I record, which probably won't be till Sunday. Um, and I kind of was like, dang, today it could have could have been a work day. That's not a soda. Y'all so silly. Um, but anyways, and so I was, I had all these clothes still, these clothes, you know how Amazon clothes come in the, and I have a whole stack over there. You're welcome, baby. You're welcome. Don't, please don't, please don't make me mad by having them stickers all over your room. You say that, and then I'm going to be mad because you didn't stuck it somewhere I can't get it off. Love having girls. Um. What was I about to tell y'all? So, anyways, I'm trying to like separate them out because I have a total of I'm getting behind because I have clo more clothes coming to me, and I need to get these clothes done. Um, and like I've kind of stopped on me ordering stuff because I'm getting so many clothes sent to me. Um, some paid, some gifted, but it's starting to become a little bit overwhelming. Um, so, what I'm trying to do. Mom, 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 mom has something in her purse. I know. What does she have in hers? Mala, rip what you have in yours. So you don't have anything inside of it. No, that's mine. Tell her to go get it and bring it to me. Thank you. That's mommy. This is mommy. Yep, that's my she, cloth. She, I need she, my cloth. She, she opened oh, it. Clean my glasses. Thank you. Here comes. All right, if one gets something, uh -huh. the other one don't. I love, Malia you, I love you too, baby. Malia gon' baby, she pays attention to anything. One time she told my mom, she was like, "Mom, uh, I mean, she told my, she told my mom, my mom, uh, Mila always get her food first. Huh? And I started thinking, do I fix Mila food first? Just like not thinking. So now, like, I purposely make sure that they get their food at the same time. I make sure that I fix both of their plates. Neither one of them get it until they both sit down and they both get the plate. So I'm trying to be intentional because I know what it's like, or yeah, I know what it's like to feel like I'm like the outcast. So I don't want my kids to feel that way anyway. 
But to say that she's only five, you notice the difference? And if you just heard just now, Mila got a, a, a thing inside hers and I didn't get inside mine. And I'm like, huh? And that was just by accident. That, that was up in her purse, but. I see that. I see that. So, uh, Malia, can you close my door for me? So, um. Uh, Bye. Bye. I put my lash too far over here. So it's like bothering me. I don't think these are going to last a full seven days because of my application. But anyways, so what I do after I pick up the clothes and I send it to them and tell them what I want, I keep I keep a screenshot of it so I can know which I will show y'all, but I have prop personal information on here so I don't want to show y'all. But I have like, okay, so this is three reels. This one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. These nine pieces of clothes are supposed to be one reel, but I'm thinking about, I'm thinking about changing it into two reels because it's, it's a lot of pieces of clothes to put in one one thing. However, I was only promised I've only promised to, to provide one, but I just think it. I don't know. We'll see. So I'm trying to separate them. So and then I have this other company who sent me eight pieces of clothes, eight clothing items, and they want two reels. So I need to separate them with dresses and then this other outfit. And y'all saw that saw that earlier, but don't tell nobody. I didn't tell y'all this, but. I probably shouldn't be saying it, but y'all know I'm straight. Um, please tell me why these Amazon sellers are selling Shein clothes. I can't say anything that's like, oh my gosh, how could they? Because I've seen TikToks all over my page saying that, uh, is it Pretty Little Things or ASOS or... It's some some Aritzia maybe some high or is it Zara some some high plate pie whatever place buys their clothes from Shein wholesale and then resells them as if it was theirs. So this outfit, y'all told y'all couldn't I told y'all couldn't fit and I thought it was on from TikTok shop. Convinced it was from TikTok shop. And then I went to go try to return and I said, wait a minute, this ain't in my TikTok shop orders. And I, I, I don't know what, I said, well, maybe they sent me the wrong thing or maybe it was by accident. It never crossed my mind that this was a part of a sponsorship. I don't, I don't even remember ordering this or telling them I wanted this. But um, anyways, I ended up emailing on a company and telling, telling them that this is, this was too small. Because normally I wear a medium. But I don't wear a medium in Shein clothes because a medium is a size 6 in Shein clothes. I wear a large in Shein clothes. So yeah, I took the clothes off and I never looked at the tag. I never did. So I was just like, whatever. And then I noticed it's cut off here. So I was like, hmm, the tag's cut off, huh? So dang, okay, well I can't really see where I ordered it from because I don't have a tag. But then that's when I went to my pictures and I ended up seeing that this was that. So I was like, oh, let me email this company. So as I was emailing the company, the shorts were, the shorts were literally like this. And lo and behold, y'all, what'd that say? Shin. I say I'll be darn. I say, well, they let that one fall through the cracks. Now, is all of these clothes from, from that vendor from Shein? I don't know. Some of these clothes don't even have a tag in it. Like this one doesn't have a tag on it at all. It just has this, but very well could have had that black tag in the inside of it. I don't know. But y'all know I worked with Shein. Ooh, girl, I need to wax. <laughs> y'all know I worked with Shein. I don't know. I've lost count every month they send me new new campaigns to do um so oh, God, I got a headache. anyways i just thought that was just kind of crazy and again this doesn't have oh nope this is cut off too so y'all know what that means if it's cut off that means it's she and she and she and she and <laughs> which again I have no issue with Shein. Some people dislike Shein. Like, says I will never order from them again. You know, they have, I don't know, work labor or something like that. They make, oh, child labor. All those things and they're and unethical and all this bad rap. And I'm just thinking in my head, but wait, half y'all clothes come from Shein. They just like resold them. Cause a lot of the styles from Shein, now granted, I feel like Shein has like a high quality line and then they have a, affordable line. Most of the stuff starts off to be affordable line. I have a lot of my clothes from Shein. A lot. 
a lot of my clothes but i can't see the quality difference from like an amazon seller because i do feel like amazon quality is typically better than shein you pay more price you pay a higher price from amazon but you get a better quality so i was a little taken back however i didn't think that these clothes were bad quality except except this it was just too short for me but it was like that it's like that linen material but that's why i really thought i got from tiktok shop that's why i just knew it anyways i came here to tell y'all i was going through my clothes trying to map out i have some clothes i need to return back to amazon these are ones that i that i had ordered i did a try on i did like it didn't love it uh i didn't love it because i where would i, I where would i wear it adrian you don't go nowhere so i'm going to return that is this some jeans? Oh, girl, this is a cute skirt. Look at me, not not me checking all the. This, this is a different vendor, but this is cute. It got a got a high thigh slit, baby. Ooh, baby, it's gonna be tea night. I need to see, and I also need to separate my clothes out so Andre can know what needs to be ironed and what doesn't need to be ironed because he irons my um child. He left us in the Shein bag. In the Shein bag. Let me see. Look at that. And cut the Shein tag off. Is this the same company? Because I'm working with three different people right here. So I don't even know. I gotta look and see what's what's what. Y'all be careful in these streets, baby, because listen, this stuff probably was nine dollars on Shein and probably three dollars wholesale. And they upped the price to forty dollars for a dress. Look at their profit margin. Pretty high. All right, I am going to, am I ending this vlog here? Cause I don't think I had anything else going on tonight. Um, I got, I finally got my clothes from TikTok shop. I should have known TikTok shop has, comes in a circle, a certain bag that's red and white. Trust me, I know because Micah has, Micah has so many bags coming in here. Oh, this is cute. Oh, wait a minute. Oh my God. What do I do? Y'all. Oh my God. This is this this tell this is this is my prime example of why I should not. This is a one time God. I promise I didn't do it on you know I didn't do it on purpose, God. I just So and I'm probably like, girl, what you talking about? So I ordered this set from Amazon. And to be honest with you, I would have, it's, it's thin. So I guess it's good for summertime, but it's a short vest set. And I kept thinking, man, I really wish I had this. I really, I really want to try this and do this on try on. And I didn't realize that somehow this got put in the pile of sponsorships. This wasn't a sponsorship. This was me, me buying this. And it said it was delivered. And I'm like, no, I never got this. I never got this. So y'all know I've gotten people mail in my house by accident a couple times. And I'm sure other people have gotten my mail a couple times. So this time the first time I had a package package missing from Amazon that said it was delivered. Dang, I'm so mad. I'm gonna include it in I can't I can't include it in a sponsorship agent. This is a different vendor. What if I be just a solo reel by itself? Because I still wanna wear it. Because I think it's so cute. But anyways, child, I'm be squirreling. Um, so anyways, they what was I what was I talking about? What is wrong with me? Oh gosh, what was I just talking about? Seriously. Oh, this. <laughs> what? Ah, I can't be serious. I got to take myself serious right now. So this suit I ordered for a try on and it and I and I I literally waited a whole week later to see if it comes up comes up later in the mail and it never came. So what I did was I contacted Amazon, told them I never received the package, never received the package. Well they refunded me the money. But I did receive the package. The package is right here. So I just got a free suit by accident. Not if like I stole. It wasn't intentional, but y'all, I, I know my heart just, it, it eats me alive. I don't like any type of like con artist. That's just not, that just doesn't go with my character at all. So like it eats me alive. See, I didn't even tell y'all that. I didn't have to tell y'all that. Why I told y'all that? Cause I don't thinking, eh. y'all get what I'm saying? This is my confession, I guess. <laughs> I don't know. But I, listen, I, I I never had the conscience to steal. I've never had the conscience to, to do any of that. So 
I just feel bad now. So what I'm supposed to do, go back to tell them and then they're gonna probably say, oh, go ahead and keep it. You know, Amazon is a multi-billion dollar. So this $40 suit for them, it's just a chip off the old block. It's nothing for them. Uh, I just feel bad. Y'all, that hurricane, this hurricane is turning. It's turning and now my city is in the cone. I'm not concerned about like having to evacuate or whatever because I think by the time it gets to us, it'll be down to a category one. So maybe we'll just have rain and I don't know. I don't, if Micah can't evacuate, he'll still be here. So um, he can't leave because of his job. But that's, I come and tell y'all that I was separating my clothes out so I can know what needed to be ironed, what didn't need to be ironed and to make sure that I got all the pieces in so that I can feel, film this, film these reels. So one, two, this is, this is one reel. That is another reel, which I think is going to be so cute. Y'all, I'm really questioning, like, is all of these clothes? Oh, look, I got this really cute one. I'm going to let y'all go. <sighs> like, seriously. I don't know if they just repackaged this or what, but. And then I have all of these um, plastic bags. No, look, this ain't Shein, I can tell. Some of the clothes you can tell, just. Look how cute this little romper is. I'm showing y'all, I'm showing, I'm giving y'all a preview of all the cute clothes. Somebody left me a comment on my Instagram and they were like, um, Adrian, I heard you in your vlog saying that you had too many clothes. Have you ever considered doing like a pop-up shop? Um, and first answer to that is no, I'm not doing a pop-up shop. Uh, because I just, I don't, I'm not a good salesperson. Like when I try to have, come myself having a garage sale and they came in and they was asking me for, when I was selling all of Mala Malia stuff and they were like, you know, would you take $10 for this, $10 for this stroll? And I had it marked for 50 sure i'll take ten dollars i'm not a good salesperson like i'm not if i'm going buy a car i'd rather do it through carvana online because i ain't got to worry about going and hassle and negotiate uh, uh no no so but then she said what about donating to your local women's shelter and i was like i never thought about that there are women there are women that can use that my actually my co-worker is the president of the women's shelter here He's the president uh, on the board and he never asked me for anything and I actually mentioned to him before I said I didn't even think we had a woman's shelter but it's a secret you know like it's a it's a in a secluded place this is cute too oh <sighs> you see what I mean by I'm a little bit overwhelmed just a bit I'm just a little bit overwhelmed y'all because I gotta make sure that I have all the pieces make sure that all the pieces fit me Cause I, I did, I did message this brand and told them that, um, I can't fit them. I said I can fit the other ones, but I can't fit. This is really cute. Not me checking all of, all the tags. This is, oh, oh look at how cute. I would say I provide links, but y'all gonna have to, oh, I forgot, I forgot I ordered this. This is mine too. This, this, this ain't a sponsorship. This is me. I brought this. This, uh, brand I've worked, I've worked with them before with a paid sponsorship. I love them. Damn, this pain right here, like short pain in my temple. Um, I have this in a tan color. It's a lounge set with the shorts. And I guess they were discontinuing this because this was literally like $9 for the set. I was like, yep, give it to me. All they had was a left and a large, so I got to get a large. My other one was a medium and it fits perfect. All right, let me hurry up y'all and let y'all go. Oh, so Pumi inboxed me too, wanting to work with me. Um, but we couldn't, we couldn't come up, we couldn't agree on a number. They tried to lowball me, low, lowball me. And I just passed up on this offer. Although, because I'm just like, I've seen them work with big creators. I know my race have nothing on the, nothing on the big creators. So, um, I passed on working with them. Uh, but I've, but it does make me like, when I see other people pop up on my feed, I'm like, they got management. I know. I know they paid, they paid a, they paid a pretty penny to work with her on a paid sponsorship. I'm not me hating. Hey, I'm not, I'm, I guess I'm not hating. I represent myself and again, I told you, I'm not good with negotiating at all, at all. But I do know how to say no, because I do know my work. So when it comes down to that, I say no. And that's why I wanted to work with them. But I just, I just, I just couldn't. Like, I, I just felt like I was, was a slap in the face. So that's what I mean about certain brands like, Unless it's like a brand that I really want to work with on a gifted basis, just to like, like Estee Lauder. 
a multi-billion dollar company like you know something like that like that's a different type of thing this is a amazon um this is girl i don't know how to put this on it's not lingerie it's a dress <laughs> it's actually a cute dress okay so i think i do have everything but um anyways yeah so i was trying to say that is that everything the green dress i have that the blue yellow the multi the black yeah i have everything so i can do the reels i can do the reels okay I just gotta get Andre to iron these clothes. What was I talking about? The paid, the paid deal. The paid, yeah. So I passed on them. I passed on a couple of deals. Um, and then after I passed on them, I'll be thinking, dang, Adrian, you probably should have took that deal. But it just, I don't know. This is why I'd be wishing I had a uh, representation. But then I just, then part of me feels like I don't get enough inbounds yet to get inbounds meaning like brands reaching out to me inbounds yet to sustain me to hire a management team um you know i plan to get there and have a whole team behind me one day um but i just i don't feel like i'm there yet i don't feel that i'm at a profit yet to be able to uh and so my mindset is um keep going till i get there you know i don't know i'm gonna just Keep doing what i'm doing i know a lot of i've seen i've watched and seen a lot of creators who still work full-time jobs and still have a very successful career and that's what i want because i just i don't know if it's, i wouldn't say it's me being greedy but i know i know eventually i'll get to a crossroad to think okay adrian do you want because like the past week i have been coming home and because i've been busy at work so i haven't been able to do anything like any downtime at work to be able to work on anything for my business so I would come to work, come home, and I would spend till maybe 6.30, I got to 4.30, so maybe two hours working on captions, uh, thumbnails, uh, Lincoln products, Amazon storefront, like all of that stuff, taking me two hours to post one reel. One reel, one reel, one short. Um, so, you know, just imagine if I was trying to do a day in life also or like i used to i used to I, sometimes I, I scratch my head and think how did i how did i do that how did you how were you able to do a day in a life do a cleaning video do and edit it and upload all in the same day i don't know i just i i don't know i don't know how i was able to do that i'm way more i'm way more into fashion now so my content has shifted a bit versus uh it is still lifestyle but it my stuff has kind of shifted a little bit because uh, I really would like my vlogs to be my YouTube vlogs to be like more this is where our lifestyle this way I get to know me this is where I get to talk and sit and chat versus my shorts to be just that short short for comp short short form content not spitting all day god I've been talking I've been talking I've been talking talking I'm tired it's 902 y'all but that's it. I hope I hope I, I hope I kept y'all interested in what I had to say tonight. I was trying to separate my clothes. I got most of them done. This needs to be ironed too. I'm gonna get Andre to come over tomorrow and iron this stuff. Um, this needs to be ironed too. But that's it. I'm gonna go ahead and end this vlog here. I'm gonna get the girls to come in and do my outro. I had the cutest comment yesterday because I posted and I promise because I'm gonna keep keep rallying it on. I had the cutest comment yesterday um, when I had posted my 100K. Um, I, I wish I would have remembered the name. But she was like, I'm so proud of you. Congratulations. Um, you know, and y'all don't forget, you know, that she put in my, she said in Mala Malia's voice, subscribe to mommy's channel. I was like, oh, she watches my YouTube. I had a lot of comments and I was going through and most of them just said congratulations, but that one just like, touch my heart because I can really hear them saying subscribe to mommy's channel and love mommy here's my little outro my little outro my love Malia I know y'all want to hear it right don't y'all they don't know my pets I used to I used to be mad because I'm like oh they was watching YouTube but now they're watching Disney Channel and everything else oh that's how good how good they did it tutoring the tutor said that they are not behind she said Mala, she said the only thing that Mala needs to work on is wah, wah, because she knows shh and all the other whatever you constant, where whatever you call it, grind the teacher.
whatever you call that but she said mala has a mala doesn't know what which is like what and where so whenever she's pronouncing it she's not pronouncing it right um but she said that she teaches she but she teaches she's a teacher at the prestige prestige child she's a teacher at a prestige elementary school here and she's that she is their tutor and she said that she has kids as well that goes to her school that Mala is on their level so she said that she does not think Mala is behind she said she does think that Mala just may be a, a slow reader and she said that is okay like but she said that she's doing good at comprehension and she's good she's she's good in something else and that was just their first session so she said that she doesn't think she needs to, that we need to go uh two or three times a week she said she thinks once is enough just to kind of go over and refresh their memory on uh words and stuff and she said she said malia malia is already advanced because whenever she goes into kindergarten she's gonna already be ahead because she knows her sounds she knows her colors she knows her i don't know she said she named five things her sounds colors i don't know but Malia knows those. She said that she she said that by the time they got to the end of the session, it was she tried to get her to do sight words and Malia was over it. She just kept saying, I don't know, I don't know. So she said Malia's doing good. So that made, that made me feel so good because my best friend, her kids go there. And so she did warn me that she you know, that this tutor is very blunt. She was like, So if Mala Malia ain't doing good, she gonna tell you. So just be ready. And I'm like, Okay. So I'm picking up and I was just like so tell me she's like oh they're they're great like they're great i'm like huh i said i, I don't want to i don't want to say it but i told her that my best friend i'm not gonna even say it because i don't want y'all in the comments saying oh, yeah, yeah. just never mind you gotta know me to know what i she she understood what i meant i don't want i'm not gonna even say it uh Mala and Malia! but yeah i'm gonna do this little outro i need y'all to help me do the, the do the outro and tell them bye I need y'all to do the outro and tell tell them bye. Subscribe and love money. And subscribe and do not do not do not press this button. Oh, don't do me a thumbs up. Give me a what? A thumbs up. A thumbs up. So y'all need to subscribe to mommy's channel, channel and, and love, love mommy. Love her. Do bye. not do not unlove her. No, they'll never unlove me. I'm here forever. Bye, y'all. Until she grows to a, a grandma. Oh. I don't know why. <laughs> grandma? Grandma? <laughs>